Okay, so here's a sequence that we uh, put together that really sums up a lot of basics and uh, with the single stick and how your tools and options change uh, when the range changes. So we start off here where and I'm going to add another range further out at the end. I'll mention that after we do a recap of what we've just done. So at longer model range, he can reach my head, so I have to raise my roof block. I can't use my live hand, it's too far away. That hand goes by too fast. So I couldn't get my hand there. So off of the first roof block, I go two hits, which is one, two. That sets my stick in position for an umbrella at the same range, and then one hit for a reason. Because now it opens up my stick, it puts me in open position for a one against the one. So meeting up and then hit twice, and then meeting up two against two, but only then hitting once because I want my stick in position to throw up a roof block and change range. Now I have a live hand. I've stepped into distancia medio here, and then I hit twice as I feed the stick through. I'm here stepping, but I'm also stepping now as I deflect. Deflect with the umbrella, hit once, so now in position for inside sweep. Hit twice, outside deflect, again a live hand. It could be palm out, it could be palm up in this case because it's a blunt weapon. Depends on what you're going to do as a follow up. We're not even adding disarm, just deflect and clear and hit. Okay? And so now in position where he steps in, or I'm stepping in, and I'm meeting it with my live hand, forearm to forearm, and near the wrist. And I'm going to clear it. This is part of Uba. He does the same. The next time through, I clear it, and then I'm going to go hit with the puño, angle one, hook, throw a knee, push him out, and start again. Now to this, I'm going to add one more, which is Largo Mono. There's two, you could say there's two designations, two divisions for Largo Mono. One is he can hit my head. I can reach his head, but I can't reach much else. But I can't use my live hand from here, unless I'm running in. And so, there's also a range where he can't quite hit my head, but he tries to. Because notice this, in the course of fighting, I go from within reach to out of reach just by leaning. Alright, this is called elastico, by the way, this kind of motion. And this is, the idea is to draw his attack when he thinks he can reach you, and then he falls short, but he offers up his hand or his forearm as a target. And you can, you can damage or destroy the weapon hand, and you've really done a lot to take away his offense. <clears throat> best, off, best defense being a good offense, that kind of thing. There we are. Now there's one, one hit and follow up down here. Boom. Do the same. Now I clear it and I can go bop and hit. Even if I'm doing this and he goes to reach it, I can still clear that and hit. And I can catch him on this side. And you can always change sides. Start, so again, this is stepping through the ranges and some basic options to also give you an idea about how the stick meets up. Like, where does my stick need to end up so that I can meet up with his in the next incoming attack? And so we're at Largo Mono, out of reach, completely out of reach, where I might have been in reach initially, but I just leaned out of it and I hit him on the hand or the forearm. And he comes back and back in, same thing. And then I'm in position now for a roof block, still no alive hand. This is Largo Mono, but I can now reach him, so I hit him twice. Umbrella. Hit him once, and that puts me in position for a one against a one, hit him twice. Two against a two, hit him once. Now I step in, roof block with a live hand, where this down see medio, and I go two hits, umbrella, one hit. Now in position for inside sweep, two hits, outside deflect, one hit. All right? Now I'm stepping in closer for who but? Now we're at the range where I can use my live hand to block his arm and then I can clear the arm. He's hitting with the puño, I'm clearing and hitting with the puño, he blocks mine, so we do a quick back and forth. And off of this, I clear the last time, I go hit with the puño and hook. Throw the knee, push out, and we'll be there right, right back at uh, Largo Mono where we can start over again. And then it would be my partner's turn to practice uh, the follow-ups.